we beat our first major boss and now it's time to continue the umbrella that's also a gun we just made it to this new town as well ah if you're looking for ammo i'm your guy the name's bill welcome to bill's pills allendale branch what more than one person can't be named bill it's a common name get over it Leaks are poo poo. I agree. Ooh, I can buy a saw blade. I'll buy that. Thank you for your patronage, soldier. Watch your back out there. This is a nice little game. Ugh, I can't get any sleep with that tinker or hammer away. Not to mention the parasol gunman showing up again. Oh, the nasty rumors about those Coke 45 freaks showing up around here. The city's getting unbearable, man. I feel you, dude. Oh, hello, it's you. I just finished my book sign and was thinking about heading to Speakeasy if you still wanted to grab that drink. Speakeasy? Haha, <laughs> cute. It's a bar beneath town. Nothing special, really. You just uh, tell them the password and they let you just about in and just let, let, let anyone in. Mechanically contrived, but themat thematically very charming. Ask about the I password. Uh, I'm not going to give you the password. It's all for show, but it's part of the charm. I refuse to rob you of the experience, no matter how handsome you are. I'll catch you there later once you've figured it out. Book signing? You know what I like about you? You have no idea who I am. It's refreshing and earnest. She's famous. She's famous. What is this area? Grandma! Organ ding? Organ ding? Talk to my daughter if you want a room or be gone, drifter. Where's your daughter? Oh, this room is very depressing. This looks like a New York City apartment for $3,000 a month. Beautiful one bedroom, 58 square feet, bathroom, toilet, shower. You can even double down with that shower because it is a bathtub. You can wash your dishes in it. Dinaline. Hello, thank you for choosing our hostel, stranger. A good night's sleep is key in maintaining health and longevity after all. Oh boy, how do I break the news? Oh boy. Unfortunately, we don't have any vacancies. Thank you for understanding. Remark on the cleanliness. Huh? Excuse me? He 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 he. I like your attitude, Sonny. Trina, you should ask him if he's single. He 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 he. Sandra, I'm with a customer. Go back to your puzzles, old hag. You see the way she talks to me? Shouldn't talk to your mother like that. Alright, sir. Sorry, my hostel wasn't up to your standards. I work really hard and try to be sweet. And I don't have to take anyone's crap. So if you don't need a room, not that we have any, I suggest you leave. How's that sound? Never mind. Oh, what an asshole. Oh, I can go in all these rooms. Oh. What? Locked. This town's connected. I want to go explore, but Dad won't let me. He says it's dangerous, and so when I told him working. On the boats is dangerous too. He got really mad. All the other kids get to play. And kid, how am I supposed to get any work done when I have to watch her? Hey, what are you doing in my room? Please leave. Right, Tarm? I was thinking the same thing. I'm just stealing your money that you store in boxes for some reason. I don't know why, but I am. So, la la la, you might be getting that apartment. Is it feeling good? Why do people all store money in these things? I can't go up there. I right, will leave. We'll go further into town this way. I'm telling you. 
I don't know that kid, and I don't know where he went. The story is quite interesting. I, for one, am unconvinced. How about you, Crash? Are you uh, convinced? Not convinced. Do you hear that, filth? He's not convinced. So now, where's the child? Where is my mind? Hey, you. Probably best to keep away. All right, we'll ignore that for now. There's a bar underneath the town. We'll go to that. We don't have the passcode, though. Here's the tinkerer, it looks like. Welcome in, welcome in. Excuse the mess. I've been working on several projects at once, and my mind has been all over the place. But not to worry, I'm good at multitasking. I prefer it. In fact, devices, gadgets, gizmos, and tech. If you need it built or repaired, I'm your guy. So what is it you need fixing? Oh, I see. Act umbrella is indeed of my make. A Gumbrella MK-2. No less. And kept in fairly good condition. I suppose you aren't here to talk about make and model, though, are you? Why don't you take a load off and tell me what happened? I can imagine all the possibilities of the new place. That is the fun part. Imagining where you're going to put furniture, what you're going to buy. All that's always so fun. Never realize how expensive furniture is and you have no money anymore. You know. I see you. So you think that whoever killed your wife did so with that umbrella. Oh, this guy's wife is dead. And that it was left at the scene of the crime. That makes it your best lead. I'll tell you what I can. These weapons were contracted by Avalon Industries for their elite police force, not now known as the Paracel Gunman. Yours specifically was manufactured for an old friend of mine who joined the force about a decade or so ago. He has long since retired, I think, and spends most of his time fishing. I don't believe that he did this, but I know for certain that your weapon was the one that I made for him when he joined the gunman. Try asking that old fisherman. He frequently ends up here in all Allendale, whether it's to visit the fishing hole or the watering hole. If you can't find him, he's a regular at Speakeasy. Just past the elevator from here, someone there might know him. We have to find the fisherman. Okay. You already cheated and looked at mini ovens. Before you go, how do I put this? Tech on the Gunbrella has come a long way since the MK2. I can upgrade it for you if you've supplied me with the parts. You can grab some of the spare parts from my chest over there so we can get you started. <laughs> I'm sure you'll be pleased with the results. Oh, I did find eight parts, so that's good. After he retired, he started to spend a lot of time at the fishing hole west from here. I wonder how he's doing. Need some modifications? Bye. Increases attack power, increases reload speed. Oh. Oh, I need two more parts and I can get reload speed up. Got attack power. Kitchen without an oven. That seems so weird to me. Oh, hey. You going in there? Ask about the speakeasy. It must be new around here. This is the speakeasy. Great place. Kind of over the top with the whole password thing, though. Good drinks, good company, etc. I'm just hanging out here until Maro shows up. Ask about Maro. Oh, Marley? She's the bouncer here. She rules. However... She must be running late or something. Saw her with the dregs and a couple of scrappers earlier heading toward the wilds west of town. Things tend to get pretty rowdy when they're together. Able, uh... Oh, hey. Ask about the scrappers. You sure ask a lot of questions, huh? Able, uh... Tamara. Ha ha! Man, I never thought I'd be able to tell you I uh, pulled the I can't tell you card. Everyone knows the password, man. But seriously, I'm not telling. Password's probably just password, right? Things locked. Uh -huh. Password. Don't waste my time. God oh, damn it. Adio. Come on. I told you I don't know anything. You gotta believe me. Ha! Shut up. Hey, oh, these are the gunmen. Our efforts are wasted on Barrel Boy here, while our prey goes deeper into hiding. Move out with pleasure. 
Oh, and don't you worry. We'll take good care of the bastard. I want an air fryer. They seem so good. Sorry, it's been a long day. An air fryer seems so convenient to have. Especially for, like, frozen food. Oh, we can go here now. We'll save the game and sit down. Where could he have run off to? Oh, hey there. That's an unfamiliar face. Are you heading out into the wilds? Be careful, man. A lot of beast. Now, on the southern route to the fishing hole and the scrappers in the junkyard to the north don't warm up the people easily. Certainly not safe for a kid to be out. Ask what happened to the kid. Ah, when the gunman showed up earlier, I told my nephew to run and hide. He knows better than to hang out on scrapper turf, so... If anything, I assume he ran toward the fishing hole. If you're heading out there, can you keep an eye out for him? He's a smart kid, and I trust he'll show up, but... The fishing hole. Yeah, there's an old fishing hole. If you follow the southern route through the wilds, it used to be a lot more popular, but things have gotten a lot more dangerous in the last few weeks. I guess Marley fought off some kind of monstrosity a bit ago. Tough lady, that one. But ever since the wilds have felt a bit more angry. Disconnected from nature, I guess. We you follow the northern path of the wild, through the wilds, you end up there in the junkyards, but I'd be careful if I were you. The Scrapper Gang uses it as their base. They're not bad, per se. I actually helped fend off some of those Avalon cronies last time. There was a big raid. They're just uh, hard. Okay. You never use your oven anymore? I can't picture not using my oven, but I'd also, I also don't have an air fryer, so... Find the missing kid. Speak to Marley. So we need to go to the junkyard, find the sign, and find the kid. West junkyard, fishing hole, east Allendale. Don't have a plan of the actual sizes. Like, you don't have, like, a floor plan that tells you how big everything is, or... Oh, I can destroy those. One day, well, there's a... Uh, do you, anyone know those um, places that uh, sell really cheap, like, items that don't go to make... That don't make it to retail stuff? And it's, like, half off because there's something wrong with it? What the fuck? I don't like killing turtles, but I'll do what I have to. This looks like a cute game so far. Minus killing turtles, I agree. Like, we have one of those right near our apartment. And I kind of and there was an air fryer there the last time we went, and I kind of want to go see if there's an air fryer there still. Because I'm very curious to try an air fryer. or something like that. Yeah, they just sell the stuff that... Like, there's nothing inherently wrong with it, but potentially there could be something wrong with it, so you have to be, like, careful, but... Hey, what up, Gatorade? How are you doing? And Mrs. Pirate, hello. Why did, how, why did you get... Oh, wait, you got... You did stand, sorry. I got in the middle of a conversation, Mrs. Pirate. Jesus. Talking about air fries, and you're making me stand here? Good for me anyway, so thanks. Give me one sec. Or customers. Hey, either way. Last time we went, we almost bought an air fryer there. But I ended up buying it. Oh, there goes the audio. I accidentally disconnected the Go XLR, the most sensitive thing in the world. Uh, we'll get it back. Don't worry. We'll get it back. Very sensitive. My Go XLR. Uh, should be good.
Oh, I don't hear the game though. Shit. Where's the game? With the title. Yes, we'll just restart. We will restart the game. Maybe that will work. Play. You can hear me. There it is. Uh, just had to do a quick restart. That's the one negative of standing up with my setup because I only have so much. Wires are only so long. Cumbrella. Uh, file one. You loaded me into a turtle. Next game. Loaded me into a turtle. like a bee. Game feels loud. How's that? Did the fast all day yesterday and got to eat after 6 p.m.? Why'd you have to fast? Thank you. Thank you for caring enough about my stream to let me know when audio is not good. on my bladder, heart, and kidney. Fun times. Ooh, I hope the results are... results that you want to see. Hope they're good results. I will say that. What do we got here? Oh, a little checkpoint. Next game. I hope my mic doesn't pick up the parts that I do sometimes. You ever just like stream video games on the internet? Then accidentally like let one rip like a Beyblade? <sighs> Kidney shows a spot that they are worried about, but you're hoping it's just a cyst like last time. Oh, I hope it's nothing serious. I guess the good news is if it is something serious, the positive is, like, can't you just get rid of the kidney if it is something, like, very bad? Because humans can survive with one kidney. As long as we don't smell it. Uh, it smells exquisite. Don't have to worry about kidney stones. Fuck you, you want me to get kidney stones if you have two kidneys? Listen, I don't know much about kidneys. All I know is my brother only has one. You already get them thanks to your dad. Way to go, Mrs. Pirate's dad. Damn kidney stones. Way to go. I'll yell at him. I hear they are absolutely horrible. I have never had a kidney stone. I will heal because I only have one band-aid left and I got hit by a bee. 
And I got hit by another bee. This game is a little bit harder to play while standing up. We got a honeycomb. You'd vomit if you think someone told you you had kidney stones. Well, then you're vomited and you got kidney stones you need to get rid of. This doesn't sound like a good combination. Maybe control your vomit. So you only have to worry about kidney stones and not worry about vomit as well. I just died by touching a frog. So some enemies you can touch. Some enemies you can't touch. Okay, first off, frog, get out of here. How much progress did I lose? Not that much, it looks like. I don't think kidney stone pain is something anybody wants to deal with, besides maybe... What are those people that like pain? Masochist? No. Masochist? And even then, they probably won't be like, Oh, baby, a kidney stone. Oh, man. It's like, yeah, I had a kidney stone the other night. It was fantastic. You no one ever say that about a kidney stone. I'm gonna use my last med kit. What are the signs of even a kidney stone? Oh my god. Let's destroy all of these. We gotta redo all that because I died to a damn frog. Yeah, sure. We're talking about pissing rocks. <laughs> what a uh, great timing on that name. All right. Your past self left me a bottle of nice lemonade in the fridge. Go past La La La, making life better. Wish I had a damn band aid or something. I uh, do not want to go through all this again. making you for food today what i'm making y'all food what do i look like your mom make sure you eat your raisins gotta have your snack oh i'm not trying to quit why would i quit I don't trust whatever's down there. Find the fisherman. A 
Hey there. But I, uh... Hey, good to see ya. I imagined I might run into you out here, given that we're both such big fishing enthusiasts. I haven't caught anything yet, but that's part of the fun. Care to join me? You alright, pal? Mommy, please. I haven't eaten in days. Don't call me mommy. Thank you for the 100 bits. Ask him about the Gunbrella. That was indeed my Gunbrella. When you walked into my home and I saw that thing, I don't know. It brought back memories. I retired for a reason. Escaped, more like. I joined the Parasail Gunman as, I don't know, a way out. Doll was working hard and getting sick in the mines, and I just wanted a better life for us. And it was better for a while. I'd go back to work, protect and serve all that. Then I'd get home, kill some time fishing. They used to be this sweet little kid that would fish out here. I always thought that was nice. The world is just hard. But this kid would just be here smiling and fishing away. But then... <gasps> let him continue. Well, the assignment got posted to do my job, that is. They wanted children. For whatever the reason, those folks over in Avalon can't have children of their own. Father Wormwood told me it's because of their sin. Flew too close to the sun or something like that. Oh, they're like Icarus. And I couldn't do it. But I did set out to do it. You ever walk into a place that used to greet you with smiles and see pure terror on every face? Switch that. In my uniform, these people, parents, children, friends, they saw me for the monster I truly was. Kids stopped coming to this fishing hole after that, and I stopped going to work. I imagine one of the other parasail gunmen snatched her, but I still fish here just in case she shows up. Georgia. What a pretty name. That weapon. When I retired, I pawned it. Who bought it? I'm not sure what his name was. I remember him having a scar across his face. He didn't stick around long, but he used to run with the scrapper gang who chub around these parts. I think he had the huts for Marley. Ask what Marley's whereabouts. Oh, her, she's a town favorite. Works at the speakeasy. I want to give you tuna and not a red heron, so take this with a grain of salt. But if you want to know who killed your wife, Marley has the answer. Here's the password to the speakeasy in Allendale. You can probably find her there. Don't write it down anywhere. The locals will kill me. And hey, I am truly sorry. Aw, he's just an old man. Let's go kill that old man game is dark. This game is a little dark. A dude is weak right now. Yes, sure. Look what we have here. Look what the cat dragged in. <laughs> what should we do with him, mama? Mama, let's boil him. <laughs> that would be cool. <laughs> right, mama? Wouldn't that be cool? <laughs> Silence! But yes. Yes, sure. That would be cool. <laughs> Kill them! Jerry! I'm Oswald, not Jerry. Not Jerry. Yes, of course. Oswald, prepare your blood for sacrifice. Okie dokie, mama. Aw, oh, come on! I never get to do the fun stuff. You will pay for destroying my home and murdering my baby! From the deaths I birth thee, nephew! Should this blood offer not satiate thee, I present to you fresh meat! The fresh meat of Bel Air. Oh, we block him. Oh, we shoot the we shoot the tentacle. All we have to do is shoot the tentacle, it seems. This is like the second boss that we have to do. Now we have one health. No, I, I have no health. <laughs> uh, I have no health. Uh, turns out, uh, yeah, I got destroyed. Do it again. All right, come here. Come here, nephew. Yeah. Yeah. 
Okay, I ran into it like an idiot. Isn't it nice to get a day away from Starfield? After like 60 hours of it. Dragon Link, your soul's also not dark. You're a lesbian. Lesbians can't have dark souls. They run the they rule the world. Who rules? Who runs the world? Girls! Who runs the world? Girls! Shit. Okay. Yes. Do you hate Starfield? One, two. Lesbians can't have dark souls. You heard it here first. Burr is sexist. What? Keeping games from the lesbians. Okay, well, he hit me. Okay, so I can't dash through when it's going down. Okay. To be fair, I lost like two of my health on that one because I ran into the damn sign like an idiot. I ran into these things like an idiot. And I didn't hit A fast enough. Because usually my thumb hits the A button. My thumb is on the right stick for precise aiming. You got to tell you about this Twitch user that came for Overwatch. Kind of crazy. I like how this came from speaking of lesbians. Let's hear about a Twitch user that came for Overwatch. I assume on your stream you were playing Overwatch. How's the game? Just got back from the office. Pretty hard. Pretty dark as well. The story seems a little dark, but overall, I will say a good time. I'm enjoying it. I intend on beating it. Maybe today, maybe tomorrow. There we go. Uh, defeated nephew achievement unlocked. My first follow for Overwatch, and I regret letting them stay for as long as they did. That's the thing. Once someone's weird, like, once I get the second, like, a hint of someone being, like, a little extra weird, um, I'm like, get the f*** out of here. Like, I can handle weird because, you know, I have all of you. Let's be honest, you guys are kind of weird. But, like, once someone's, like, extra weird, it's like, okay, yeah, get out of here. Fixing shit. I assume the life of a dev is constantly working. Are you the... F they were like, you were the first lesbian that was nice to me. Made you super comfortable. I, I presume you mean uncomfortable. It was just plain rude. I feel like a lot of people don't really know how to talk to other people because of the... because of social media and uh, the internet. People don't know how to talk to humans.
And then when they get called out for being weird, they're like, oh, wait, that was a joke, you see? It was a joke. I would never be weird. It's like, okay, yeah, sure, boss. You ever just wake up and hate the internet? Because I do. I wake up and I'm like, damn it, man. Why do I have to fucking post on Twitter every day? I have come to the realization I'll just post random stuff on Twitter and then never look at it. And then remember about it when I open Twitter and be like, oh, I have a notification. It's like, oh, yeah, I made a tweet. Good job, me. They would call me bestie and say oh well a lot and called me a furry because my png tube and i said i was adorable but when i would play and not overwatch ata's they were like man you found another game i hate like question mark question mark bro so they got mad at you for playing a game that you wanted to play and they called you bestie hey bestie Hate watching? That's what this chat does. I'm convinced that there's at least two of you in here that secretly have it out for me. Password? You're in. I'm in. We watched Burn. He hates us. Whoa! What up, not good gamer? That's a big accusation that you can probably have lots of evidence for. Dragonling plays Ace Attorney. She's my lawyer and will defend me in court. Yeah, I'm one of them. Nice. Yo, if you're hate watching me, just let me know. I can thank you. And we can have a nice discussion. Oh. Hey there, sugar. Don't get a lot of new faces around here. What can I get you started for? Marley's whereabouts. Oh, looking for Marley, huh? Things don't go so well for out of town as looking for Molly. Toughest woman I've ever met. She's security here, if you can call it that. She mostly just hangs out and drinks, but if there's ever a problem, she takes care of it. You ain't a problem. These are hate Are bits. you? Thanks for the hundred hate bits. I greatly appreciate it. Thank you, thank you. Hey. Pretty silly, huh? Back when we opened, there were far more less than savory folks who could show up causing problems. We had a password then, one that was actually hard to guess. But stopped really needing one after Molly started whooping anyone who looked at her funny. Now we just have a silly little password as, I don't know, a homage of sorts? To the old days, you know? At least you finished Ace? I finished it too. I won Ace Attorney 1. That's finishing. <laughs> Nothing else up here? That's what you had to deal with when you were on four hours of sleep? Sounds atrocious. Oh, hey. Marley, she's the bouncer. Yeah, I know Marley. I need to find Marley. She's on that west side. I wonder how much sleep I got last night. Luckily, my phone always tells me. Umbrella is on my wish list and on sale. Sorry, Steam, I got it for free. I'm just here to check how much sleep I got. Oh, I don't think it tracked, actually. That sucks. I wanted to know how much sleep I got. Guess my phone wasn't didn't have enough juice. Wait, did uh, did Unity say something about all the controversy they got? What'd they say? You know, I'm in the middle of playing a game in a Let's Play, but if, if they, do they have a tweet? I want to read this. The Unity stuff is fucking mind-blowing. It's mind-blowing how stupid a company could be. Reinstalling the game still counts as a new installation. The new Unity runtime fee applies to every game ever created with the engine once it takes effect. Both after 
and games already made before January 2024. They've said that charity bundle purchases are exempt from this fee, but you're not sure how the installs will be excluded. That's so stupid. So for people that don't know, Unity is, uh, is a tool that a lot of people use to make games. And they are gonna, they announced yesterday that it started in 2024. They're gonna have a fee after a certain, after, is it a certain amount of installs or is it after a certain amount of revenue? It was one of those. They're gonna apply a fee to every single install install not people playing the game or just buying the game you know they maybe get a little tiny two cents every install on the game they are going to charge a fee and people like us we could just screw over developers and just uninstall reinstall uninstall reinstall uninstall reinstall constantly and it applies for it, it applies for all games made in unity and it even applies for like Xbox Game Pass games. So if a developer has a deal with Xbox Game Pass and they made their game in Unity, yes, they get a check from Microsoft, but every time someone installs their game, they're losing money. And they basically, they get screwed. They're, they're fucked. It's like the worst thing that you could see. Cult of the Lamb was made with Unity. And Massive Monster, the creators of Cult of the Lamb, said they were going to delete their game if that happens, if it goes through. Big hey Danny, you guys are with Unity as well? Or making your game with Unity? Oh, Why'd I say Big Danny? That, that was weird. Yeah. Oh, that is heartbreaking. But yeah, ba basically, that's what Unity is doing, and it fucking sucks because there's a lot of games that you play, that we all play, that were made with Unity. You may not now because of that. I'd suggest Unreal Engine. Carbon Engine. I hear the Unreal Engine's not too bad. I, I personally don't know. I'm not a game developer, nor do I have the skills to be one. But I imagine nothing is as greedy and as bad as Unity. What's even what's even worse is the freaking Unity, the, the, the CEO of you, the, the higher ups in Unity, they sold a bunch of stocks like last week, like a bunch of shares, not stocks. They sold a bunch of shares last week before this news came out because they knew it was going to be controversial and drop their stock tremendously. Which I, I, you know, I'm not, you know, a law enforcement person. You know, I'm not anything like that, but I feel that's insider trading. Maybe. Really hope they get sued. I saw a tweet saying that, uh, I think someone said in the Discord, I think Monk said in the Discord that some devs are already planning to sue them. Uh, but yeah, Unity really fucked up. And it's really just like, you get like, it's horrible for the gaming industry if that goes through. I will just say that right now. Absolutely horrible for the gaming industry if Unity goes through with that. It's much easier to learn it. Their learning curve is better. That's it's it sucks. There's so many games that I play that when I load it up, it just says made with Unity. And I'm like, oh cool. It's a Unity game. Oh yeah, I there, it's one of the worst things of this year that I've seen. Junkyard, no trespassing, no soliciting, no bullshit. Save the divers, Unity. Small devs are not as effective, but the one-hit wonders that are free to play are doomed. 
Yeah, but still, it, it affects everyone, you know? I know you used to win in Marley, but this time I've brought my lucky marbles. That's Twitch chat every time we play marbles on stream. I know you I know you used to win in A1, but I brought my lucky marbles, says Catloaf, as they fall off the map and die three times in a row. You don't stand a chance. You hear that, Marley? Looks like Brad's getting a big hit for his britches. Look at the big brain on Brad. You gonna let him talk to you like that? Bringo. Can it, Dregs? I can handle this punk on my own. Huh? huh? Who's that? What the hell do you want? Speak easy. I'm in the middle of a game, man. You're all under inquiry. Crap. Let's scram. I knew this old man was setting up Marley. He's got the umbrella and everything. Let's scram, boys. Ha 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 ha. Oh, what's this? Oh, whoa. Ooh, ooch. I see you found yourself a little toy. The worst part of this, regardless of any rollback on Unity's part, is that they have proven they are willing to make massive fee changes with little notice and apply them retroactively. Yeah, and basically they they lose consumers' trust. The trust is gone, even if they roll it back. It's like, okay, they're they could do this again at any moment. Didn't anyone teach you? You shouldn't take what doesn't belong to you. There's a lot of companies that are trying these fucking fees and subscription models and making them more and more expensive and more bullshit. Nevertheless, I have a great many concerns and a gaggle of second-rate thugs fraternizing with a wannabe gunman is. Least among them. Which begs the question... Did you see a young boy with those filthy ruffians while you were fraternizing? Answer me, vermin. No. I see. Very helpful, insect. Thanks for wasting my time. Hold on to that weapon, boy. The next time I see you slinking around, you're gonna want to know how to use it. He killed my wife. That's my guess. It's best not to forget your place in this world, worm. Man, now I lost freaking Marley. Hey! No way, bucko! You tried to set us up, so there's no way I'm letting you in. I already told you, man. It doesn't matter how many times you try. I'm not opening this gate. I could wait here all day. I have plenty of stuff to keep me occupied, like my bag of marbles to practice playing Burr's Marbles on stream so I can pick a game that he plays on stream. Wow. It's really weird that they added that sentence to the game. I must have dropped them when we were running from the gunman. Oh, he dropped some marbles. Let me go get his marbles. Of course. The <laughs> music. We haven't gone this right side, I don't think. Oh, I should probably... Did we go this right side? How did we get here? Did we go this right side? Oh, yeah, we came in from this right side. There is actually a treasure chest right over there. Maybe I should try to get that. Yeah, Jeffrey, you know, it's... I feel like we're going to see a lot of delays in uh, some games. As people need to learn how to make use a whole new game dev kit. We got a band-aid. Nice. Oh. 
You'd be okay if delays have been fucking unity. I'm with you. I'm with you on that. Fuck unity. Piece of shit company. Jeff Reno, I yeah, have people uh, I've heard. I've heard. I haven't seen anything, but I've heard people have said that devs are already planning to very much sue. And I hope that they can. There's some pretty. Uh, isn't Genshin Impact made with Unity? I was watching a video this morning and they said Genshin Impact was made with Unity. Which would mean that's a lot of fucking money that Genshin's gonna lose. Sure, they have a lot of money, but you know, it's their money. The freaking Pokemon Scar- uh, Pokemon uh, Diamond and Pearl remakes made with Unity. Also, what's up, Waffles? I hope you're doing good. Hope you're doing good. Pokemon Diamond and Pearl! The freaking Unity's gonna come knocking on Pokemon Store. Uh, there was 20 million installs of this game, and about, uh, they've been reinstalled about 57 million times. We will take, uh, 20 cents for every single install. The fuck? Get the fuck out of here. Who do you think you are, Unity? You going at the Pokemon? Good luck! Doing good indeed. How am I? I am doing good as well. Playing, uh... Gunbrella. We might finish it today, but we'll see. Is that a bag of marbles? Okay. Here's how this is gonna work. I'm gonna pull this lever and move that blockade. And you're gonna come inside, leave the bag of marbles at the gate, and then turn around and leave. And in exchange, I, uh... Just please give me my marbles. Waffles, I'm gonna say you and Fiona got a cat. Based off questionable decisions. So pull exceptions for big companies, because that's always how it goes. Please give me my marbles. Ow, am I supposed to give you the marbles? Please give me my marbles. Thanks. It dawns me that even if I flip this lever again to turn this magnet off, the barricade won't just move itself back into the doorway again, so... Please don't tell anyone I let you in. <laughs> Not quite yet. That probably is going to be this weekend. Oh? Well, other questionable decisions. Good job! Is Honkai Star Rail also made with Unity? That's the game that uh, is made by the Genshin people. Kat was playing that yesterday. And I was like, oh, Genshin. And she's like, that's not Genshin. And I'm like, it looks literally the same. It looks like a clone. Idiot can't swim. You skip class to go wait in line for one of those Pokemon decks? Did you get it? People in Discord were trying to get them as well. I don't know if anyone in Discord got them, though. I was first there and the place only had two, so yes. Yo, congrats on the board. Pokemon. Do you not have any more ammo, good sir?
Any time for a new dev vlog where it says, So, our big hard work and project, we have to restart everything because Unity decided to fuck us. So, this game. What's up, Dido? Did I beat Starfield? No, I did not beat Starfield yet. Taking a day off from Starfield to uh, play Gunbrella. As I've been looking forward to this game for a little bit. We'll probably... I'm trying to beat Starfield by, like, the end of the week, I'd say. Oh, please. I was blocking that. Oh, please, man. Give me a band-aid. Ugh. Enough about me. How is this game so far? This game is good. It's very hard. I will say that. It's pretty hard. But overall, a good time. I wish I could save a little bit more, but, you know, that's okay. Also, Dido, hope you're well. What the hell is this? I got a weird looking email. Just telling me a game's now available on Steam. Okay. Cool. Also, we have a Nintendo Direct tomorrow. Cool. Nintendo Direct, yeah. Yeah, baby. Howdy has returned. Yep. Yeah, Daddy Devolver. I made a going live tweet for once just so I could add Devolver because I like them so much and they liked my tweet. I felt so special. Daddy Devolver. Good old daddy. Hey, long time no see, pal. Can't thank you enough for returning my gem to me. I've got some very interested investors curring me now. They love old Seward. Oh, yes, they do. Don't worry, man. I'll let you in on a slice of the pie. Inquire about the investors. Ah, I found that gem in a junk pile years ago and always coveted it. But I'm getting hungry and living in the sewer ain't what it used to be. Now that there's monstrosities and wraiths popping up everywhere. I want to sell it and open, I don't know, a casino? A sewer? A shop. Buy. I could buy a grilled rat. Sure, I'll buy a grilled rat. Oh, this place I grew up here. I never joined that scrappers gang, but they respect my ineffable wisdom wisdom, and my cooking. Ha ha ha. Oh, this guy's cool. Thanks for lurking, Kalisar. I appreciate it. A reinstall on the same device does not get charged again. I don't really trust that if Unity said it. Hope you're hungry. Would you like to hear the specials of the day? What about the specials? Ah, I could tell you were a foodie when you walked in the door. Today we're starting off with a gorehound soup with a herbal garnish. Very yummy, but not very filling. Second course, of course, is my world-famous roasted garlic. Rather healthier, yes, yum. And to round off the meal, we have a mystery steak. I can't tell you my secret recipe because Dregs would freak off his leash if he knew what goes into it. But I can tell you that it is the most delicious food that has ever existed. It will literally heal your feeble, broken bones. Trust me, it's delicious. That's what I like to hear, baby. Can I sell stuff? That's just a reasonable price. Oh, I can sell lots of stuff. Let me sell all this crap. Alright. The source is Totilo, who was told this by Unity CEO, apparently. Unity CEO? I wouldn't trust anything that guy says. Wasn't, didn't, wasn't he an EA executive? Yo, what up, crawfish eater? Thanks for lurking. I appreciate it. I say this as an EA network creator, but uh, I don't trust an EA executive, that's for sure.
Heroes are introduced when they introduce loot boxes. It's crazy how scummy companies will be for more money. You know? Hmm. Huh. Huh. You feel amazing. I look amazing too. All right, YouTube Let's Play. You can wait until the next episode of this game while we finish up the scrapyard, but you can wait till next time. Thanks for watching, YouTube.